search Steven David's can you know I really wanna get to know you Hey guys welcome to the second video of our shuffling tutorial series again I'm Dean as John Today we're going to be teaching you the second compound move of the shuffle, the T-step, also known as the side step. You want to get started? Let's go. Right guys, so basically, here's the T-step and how it's supposed to be done. Right, but before you can even think about starting this, I would suggest that you get used to a similar movement which will get you used to what you have to actually be doing. Once you get used to this movement, you'll be ready to put your feet up and down to match the movements of the T-steps and perform the actual T-step. On the floor, gotta give it up, gotta give me some more. Right. I want you to assume the position and let my fingers explore. From here on you can put in some variations, kicking and putting your feet in different places once you get used to it. Right. Let's go into a bit more detail. You can begin to integrate it with the running man. This is the actual shuffle where you combine the two moves, the T-step and the running man. As you can see, while he's going from one side to the other, he uses the running man to transition, therefore creating the shuffle. Here's how combining the running man and the T-steps can look, especially when synchronized with two people. Right guys, I hope you enjoyed the second video of our tutorial series. Stay tuned for next week's video where we will be explaining the Spongebob which isn't really shuffled but can be used in it. Anyways, we'll see you next week.